I am a 78 year old retired veterinarian. My name is Ed Epperson. And I became really attracted to Buck Branneman when his movie came out several years ago, I think about five years ago. I had been a rodeo cowboy and been a veterinarian who treated horses for a while and had some experience with horses and was really pleased with the way he talks now and then about how to effectively ride a horse. To see if that's going to work. And he confirmed it. Then I might back left here and say, now just bring your front end around your back end this way. And that's fine. And I have studied ontology uh, for 40 years. Ontology basically indicates that you're doing what you're doing when you're doing it for no reason. So if you're playing the guitar or washing the dishes or mowing the lawn or riding a horse uh, just because, kind of like a little boy playing with a toy. Uh, so Buck has mastered the communication of how to uh, approach a horse, saddle a horse, put a bridle on a horse, get on a horse, and be a horse rider who is not uh, concentrating on looking good or avoid looking bad. The job is to be a horse rider for no reason. Uh, to be a horse rider for the pure pleasure of being a horse rider rather than being someone who's sitting up straight or someone who looks good or is wearing a pretty hat or nice clothing or has a beautiful saddle. So it kind of takes away the ego and leaves the, uh, the rider uh, being in a place of enjoyment and mainly effectiveness. So I came from Austin to Belton today to celebrate uh, what Buck is doing from my particular point of view, which is someone who's been a father and a husband and a businessman and a spiritual follower and a tennis player and a snow skier and a uh, friend of lots of people for a long time. Thanks for listening to that perspective.